A new type of image recognition software could help machines, anything from robots to your cell phone, understand and identify objects around them. It's called Viper for Visual Pattern Recognition, and it's developed by Evolution Robotics. Viper uses a central database of tagged images to search for matching objects. And unlike traditional robot vision systems, Viper has no trouble identifying objects in real-world situations where lighting and focus may be less than ideal. It's designed for visual recognition the way that people look at the world. So instead of sort of looking for barcodes and characters, it's looking at patterns. It's looking at texture that we see. I've got this book, Spot Goes to School, and I hold it up, and it's recognizing that within that environment. Viper is already available on millions of cell phones in Japan, and it'll roll out on handhelds in the U.S. later this year. So what we're showing here is this is a, just a quick demo of uh, Viper technology running on the iPhone. And what it lets you do is take a picture of something and do a visual search. So you don't type anything out, you just sort of take a picture. So here we have a Britney Spears album. I actually had this in our database from a while back. And I just take a snapshot. And I have this shot, and it's not a perfect shot. It's uh, it's you know just a it's a shot from an angle, doesn't have the whole image, a little bit blurred. But what I can do with that is basically uh, send that off to a server. And what it's doing is sending it up as if I typed in Britney Spears or In the Zone, her album. I sent that off to the web, and now it's doing a search off of hundreds of thousands of images up there of all these album covers, other images from magazines, could have been people's you know vacation photos, and it's matching that specific image. And what's downloading is actually it's downloaded a description of the album, the full cover, because it didn't see it the first time. It got that from there, and all these links online. And it's, it's sort of moving away from having to type stuff, but make all the world, you know, basically be visual search. So here's what it, here's one of the links. <laughs> okay. Because all Viper needs to operate is a camera and an internet connection, the system can be installed in anything from a PDA to a $100,000 military robot. You can try Viper today by downloading the Windows software demonstration at evolution.com.